It's a rough moment across our nation and those feeling some of the brunt are members of law enforcement. But this morning news reporter Julio Avila joins us live with more on how some local neighbors are going to come together to show officers that they're still appreciated. Good morning, Julio. Hey, good morning, Aaron. Well, a group of people, they're going to be coming together to show their appreciation and support for law enforcement, especially uh, right now in this time as we've seen cities all across uh, the nation looking to reform their respective police departments. But later this morning here at the ferry docks in Currituck, several people are going to be coming together for an appreciation ride for law enforcement. That ride starting at 1030 and that uh, still open to the public. Anyone could still uh, uh, be a part of it and all you have to do is just bring a vehicle in order to ride along. Now the organizers tell us that some of the riders are actually coming from some faraway places. We've got people that are coming from Virginia. We got groups coming from far away as Greenville here in North Carolina. The Outer Banks. The Outer Banks. Um, everybody that when I first started talking to people about this, as soon as I said it, they said yes, whatever we can do to help this we won't be a part of it, that count us in. Now, right now on your screen, you should be looking at an American flag made out of metal. This was made by Michael Boyce, one of the co-organizers who you saw to the right. He made 11 of these, which will be presented to 10 local agencies and one selected officer. Now, they also tell us this is to also emphasize community and how the community came together to make all of this possible. Now, again, that appreciation ride starts at 1030 here at the ferry docks in Currituck, and it's going to end at Twyford Funeral Home in Elizabeth City where that presentation will take place and we hope to bring you this story as well tonight on News 3 at 6 o'clock and all the information is also on WTKR.com. In Currituck, Julio Avila, News 3.